we're giving banter! Bat rap! Woo! Psyker is gonna malediction enfeeble your uh, knob and he's going to get his ability with flying colors. You can deny the witch on a six up and you don't. First things first, I'm gonna move up my Mauler Fiend. It's right in close, in your face, right there. This is not too bad. That is true. You do plan on yeah. overwatching me. So, I did. this is my strategy. Dude. I'm going to move this Chaos Cultist group up yeah. here, six inches. You're gonna like this because it's uh, it's tactics. <laughs> this, you know what I'm doing. Do you know what I'm doing? Yeah, I, I have a feeling, tingling feeling. A tingling mm. feeling. Now Green this guy fingers. here, he's going to detach himself from the unit and he's going to uh, yes. move over there in this direction. This Chaos Cultist is going to run back this way. All right. He's actually, hold on, he's going to move uh, this way because um, he doesn't need to be there at all. I, I can see he's cowering. He, like he the is, that's totally fine though. He can cower <laughs> all he wants. If he see, was fearless what? and he was cowering, that'd be a different story. Halbrook's gonna move up. Uh, almost the same as Cultists, except what I do with my orcs, I just charge them all forward, get shot, eh, just keep going. You, you, you haven't even got shot yet, and you're still carrying. Cultist squads are awesome. They are so oh, awesome. Oh, are they really? I, I must say, yeah, they are just absolutely awesome. Okay, they look good. I'm not gonna lie. The models look pretty awesome. But... Yeah. Okay, now I'm gonna go into the shooting phase. So the Chaos Cultists, they only three of them can actually uh, shoot you for shooting attack. So we're gonna go like that, and none of them hit. This Chaos Cultist, he's gonna run four inches. Denying is good. I, he actually went up on the tape measure. Now let's just pretend that he's uh, about so there. Far, I didn't plan off. that. I am not attempting to do anything I shouldn't be. Chaos shenanigans right there. I swear. I swear. <laughs> <laughs> that's you making fun of me, making fun of you. Uh, I like it. Yeah. So that's it for shooting. Now for assaults, I'm going to declare an assault on your squad right there with this Chaos Cultist group. Now, if you choose to overwatch, you can, but if you don't overwatch yeah. them, you don't have the option of overwatching anything else that does it after this. Yeah. So that, that's why that's happening. Okay. And that's not shenanigans. So what would you like to do? Okay, that's it. I'm gonna you, overwatch. You wanna overwatch? Okay. Six is hit. You have one six. Now you are twin length. Yeah, that's a little better. One more six. Oh, <laughs> so now you need twos. And you got one one there, so one guy dies. First guy. Now I roll for assault range. I get eight inches. That's probably not enough, but I'm not gonna measure it. So it's not within, because you're about 10 inches away from me. So had you not killed that first guy, I probably would have been in range. Oh, great. Yeah. Wow, Which I love my life around this. You uh, would have taken me out there, so. That's interesting. Now my Mauler Fiend is going to assault you, and he's going to get 11 inches when he's one inch away, so that's good. And uh, boom, boom, boom. Now Hellbrute, he's going to assault. That's his distance. He's in. Right. All right, so this guy, the uh, Sorcerer, he's going to assault you. He's within range there, and he's going to absolutely go in. And so. that's that. So now I'm going to go to the Mauler Fiend. I'm going to see what he does. Now since I have Power Fist on my Mauler Fiend, and it's unwieldy, I attack at an initiative one. I think that's the way it is. I don't think he gets any special abilities because he's a walker and he gets to assault yeah. at regular. So you're gonna go with your three inch pile in move, is that correct? Yeah. Well, Stacka moves last because he's initiative one, so he moves after, so. I also cause fear. So you need to take a leadership test, which you get. So that's good, because you would have been reduced to weapon skill one, which would have made it uh, easier for me to hit you. Your guys are minus two attacks mm -hmm. each. So how many attacks do you have base? Uh, that would be, that would be one attack each, great. Minus two attacks, wow, So that's you're fun. you're one attack each? That's one attack each. Dude. No, you can't do anything because I'm front armor 12, you have to attack my front armor. Brilliant. The minus attacks doesn't even matter. So now it's the initiative one, Pile in step. How many uh, attacks does Wazdaka have? Okay, it's attacks of four, which is pretty awesome. Four attacks? Yeah. Okay, so you're down four by two, attacks. so you're two attacks. Two attacks. We okay. attack at the same time. I'm strength 10, so I'll, I'll just attack you first, okay? Four attacks, this is gonna hurt. Wazdaka is weapon skill five. I gotta roll fours? Yeah. Okay, so fours to hit you. Ouch. Did you get anything? Nope, I, 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 I missed every single one. Yes. Okay, so yes. now it's your yes. go. So now Wise Darker can attack strength eight. 
two attacks. So you need uh, threes to hit me? Strength, uh, weapons go five, yeah? So. Yeah, so you got two hits. Strength eight, so your four is glance. You have uh, one glancing hit. I'm a demon. Let me uh, roll my five up and vulnerable save because of that. Dude. And I actually make it, so that's that assault. Now we'll go on to this assault right here. First off, my chaos champion here, he must challenge you. He's gonna challenge your uh, knob. You do accept. You do accept, okay. So we're gonna go I off to the side here. Accept. My Halbrood has power scourge, so I'm gonna roll a D3. And that's uh, how many weapon skill points I take away from the guys that are in base contact, which is one. So this one guy right there. So I'll put a little die next to him to remember. The Tau die. It's a Tau weak die to remember. Oh. Now for the spawn, here are the number of attacks. He gets five attacks this time. Mutated beyond reason. I get a result of two. Grasping pseudopods, the chaos spawn unit rolls 2d6 and picks the highest for their random attacks. So I got a 5 before, so I'm going to roll another die here and I get a 6, so I actually get 6 attacks. Ouch. Yeah, that's uh, it's, it's not bad, it's pretty good. So my spawn causes fear, you got to do your leadership test, which is 7. seven. You get 7 right on. So that's, uh, that's you're, you're nice. lucky right there. So I need 4s to hit you. I get 3, so it's exactly statistical. And okay. I need fours to wound you. And I get three wounds. Four plus armor nice. save. You fail two of them. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was a good noise. I like it. That's a shame. It's an extreme. So now these two guys attack back. Now, do you want to attack my Hellbrute with the one guy, or do you want both of those guys to attack the Chaos Spawn? Uh, I think the Chaos Spawn. That's how uh, I get yeah. kill point. That's, that's smart. Smart decision. That's two attacks each. Fours to hit me. That's one four that's to wound me. And that's enough. Oh. Three attacks, so I'm threes to hit you. So that's only one, but I'm two to wound you because I have a power scourge. And I get a wound, and uh, oh. you, you don't have a normal save, so your one guy's dead. Okay. This guy right there. Now we're gonna do the challenge. That I go first because you got a power claw. Yep. Four attacks, threes to hit you. So that's three hits, and I am okay. fives to wound you. Fives, okay. So one wound. Now, it's a force weapon, that's AP3, that means you're wounded. Yeah. Here's a psychic test to see if Oops. I can actually instant kill you. Psychic okay. test, made it, so the knob is gone. Okay. Oh, that's, that's gonna suck. <laughs> Crush. So you gotta get going now, but you're uh, okaying okay. Matt to finish the game for you, right? Yeah, I'm Necron player. I'm the nids, that's not cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'll do the best I can. All right. Well, it was good fighting against you. I'm sorry you had to very, had to leave. Yeah, I'm sorry, but it was really good while it lasted. I enjoyed it very much. So, and epic challenge shake with dice in my hand, and it's the wrong hand because we're doing. Okay. okay. Yeah, that was that was good enough. Thank you so much, man. Okay. Take care. You too. I'll battle Bye. you later. This last bike there needs to do a leadership test, and he fails. Initiative test. Two and one. One. So you got him. There you go. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, so Sorcerer, okay. Consolidate, Hellroot, Consolidate, and Spawn, Consolidate. We go this way, Hellroot, this way, Spawn, one inch. Bottom of turn two. Or Bottom of turn two? That's right. <laughs> Holy cow, that's not good. I think of Coca-Cola when I see your shirt. And, and, then, well, that's and then I read idea. Bacon. So we're just gonna go straight to this combat. That's all there is. The two attacks on the Fiend. One hits. And then strength eight. Nothing! Nothing. No yes. preferred enemy or anything? It's because the it's coolers in the room, it's a fours. And oh! Nothing. Oh! Yeah. This is gonna go on yeah, forever. Yeah, it will. We're gonna tarp at each other. Everybody else is like. So now it's my turn. Yeah. Okay, so malediction and feeble onto that unit. That's what's gonna happen right now. Right. That's what I would do. And I got it, so. Six up. Nope. nope. So they're enfeebled. Minus one strength and toughness, and all open terrain is difficult. That's right. Six inches. Let's clear the way, boys, for the hell route to walk through. Oh, they don't want to charge the bikes? Uh, no, it's okay. I don't mind doing that, but they're not fearless, and so they don't want to do it because they're not. They're going to run away because they're afraid. Speed bumps don't like to be run over as much as they're run over all the time. Hell route. Six. Sorcerer. 12 inch movement over here. Okay, so now I'm going to assault with my Hellbrute, and I'm going to not assault with my Hellbrute. I'll run with my spawn, five inches. That's about five inches. This is the beginning of the uh, shooting phase. assault phase. Oh, assault phase. So I'm going to activate my demon force. I get to re-roll my failed two wounds. So you roll first. Hit threes to hit. 
That's two hits. And then four is to glance. Actually, no, five is to glance because your strength's up. That's right. Well, I got a glance and a pen. Blue is pen. Five up. That's a one. No, that's oh, a that's six. A six. So you stop the which one? The glancing? Uh, stop the pen. Oh, the one that actually matters. Yeah, so the glance is there. So he's down to two. Thank yeah, you. Because the pen could have killed you. Because yeah. you're about to insta kill me. That's right. Hitting on fours. Oh, oh again. Nothing. Okay, looks like we're going to be at this for a while. And, uh,. So just go straight into the close yeah, combat. Straight into the combat, but you're still enfeebled. Yes, I am. Yeah, I've learned that the hard way by fighting against you yesterday. Yeah, it's strong. Biomancy's awesome. Are right, you might as well go first. Yeah, because you might need to kill me. One hit. Nothing. All right. Hey, okay, four plus now. <laughs> Only one. one. I need a two. Three. And you insta kill. I instant kill you. Like so that's two points for you. Okay. And these guys are going to choose to fail the morale test because they cannot hurt you. So like. then we do an initiative test here. Yep. All right, so I'll, I'll roll your a initiative? five. My initiative is three. Oh, I gotta roll. A th oh, I can't beat that. Because yeah. mine's two. Even if I roll six, you've equaled me. So you've destroyed them all. I didn't have a choice, John. I'm sorry. So you tabled the orcs. <laughs> yes, and I uh, guess I could have rolled for it will not die, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, we matter. forgot to roll for it will not die. But it doesn't it matter at this point, so. It did not die. Okay, so this is the first official Chaos Space Marine battle report that I've had with the new models. How do you feel, Tau player? Do you like it? I'm, I'm just stoked. Wrong. You're stoked? So because John couldn't make the end of the battle report, he has emailed me a response, and I'm going to share his response to you. Dear all Mini Wargaming out there, do not underestimate Chaos and their points values. I believe that my most serious mistake in the small bat rep was fielding a low variety of troops, i.e. everything was on bikes. I did this because I felt that being Chaos Space Marines would have more of a small elite army that I could overwhelm with all that DACA. However, due to the new models such as cheap and cowering cultists, there is now a larger variety in 6th edition. Good game Dave, really enjoyed having a taste of the warp with the new models and hope to have a full game where I don't leave. Happy Wargaming. P.S. Wow. Just because I wasn't allowed the opportunity with the list. If you wish to challenge me, go to miniwargaming.com slash challenge. From there, we can set up a battle, even if it's on Skype. If you're a local player, come in and fight me. If you're visiting the area from another country, come in and fight me. If you're visiting me and you're here physically, we can have a bigger game. Remember to go to miniwargaming.com slash buy40k if you want to purchase a Chaos Space Marine or an Orc Army. Also, click on the link below if you wish to purchase the specific Warbike Army that you saw featured in this battle report. That army was provided by Blue Table Painting. They did a great job on that. Thank you very much, Sean, and the boys over at Blue Table. And thank you for watching this battle report. Stay tuned, and happy wargaming.